Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, Like, 2.5. Like, they cut off home real quick. Okay, if you're not gonna take requests, just 
say you're not taking work right. Right. Don't like, saying, like oh, oh, I don't have that time. Yeah, yeah that was kind of rude. Yeah. 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 Even the girl was like, oh, we're doing a dance battle. So then we went back up and she was like, oh, okay. But like, you don't have to keep me at an arm's length. Just tell me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, no, DC Spartan is crazy. I can't live here. <laughs> Y'all see what's going on? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Are you guys ready to go back? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Say so, yeah, they played a lot of like girl group songs that was kind of like not that popular. They were all right, but they were playing like some B-side tracks that we don't really yeah. play. Yeah. In public? Maybe. They play like the whole seven minute version, but as soon as BTS comes on, it was like a minute and a half. Right. The and it was lit. We were okay. dancing, but no one yeah. else was dancing to the other stuff. Yeah, okay, that's the other thing. I said I'm not scared to be like the lit person, and I'm not, but like... Okay, decent amount of alcohol, and the bartender was amazing. So shout out to him. He was cool. The drinks carried me through the night. <laughs> Listen, and I got music didn't <laughs> oh, I'm I sorry, I gotta go. All right. I didn't know you gave me that quick. Can we get in that? I wanna ride that. I'm so mad that guy touched me. Like, I don't like okay, being yeah, touched. Okay. Watch out for the poopy -poo water. Where's my vlog stick when I need it? Oh yeah, another thing, like there, the DJ and the um, MC of the night was like cuddled up behind the booth. <laughs> and every time you went over there to talk to him, he'd be like pointing at his watch, like, oh, time's up. But yeah, we still had like 15 minutes left. It's not at one till three, so if that's true, we still have like... Definitely went till three. I mean, even though it went till three, it, the songs were still whack, so... <laughs> it's past my bedtime too, I go to sleep at eight. So I'm just adding... I'm done with pizza. You can also order delivery pizza. Delivery, let's go. It's there's too many crazy. listen if y'all don't know i got really bad anxiety and just walking back there i know y'all saw i was like this great experience yeah. i would do it again i would just hope that they would have more of what we actually mm -hmm. wanted to hear i don't have to just be bts i wanted to hear more like recent exactly yeah i, I had requested i requested also blackpink till this month oh. we don't have that we only have two blackpink songs like what do you mean you don't have it like find it <laughs> it was a lot of like old school too like for example, they played um, Wiki Me Wiki. How do you say their name? Wiki Miki. Wiki. <laughs> Wiki Miki's debut song. When the same five people stop dancing, okay, that's an indicator. Okay, you should so turn I leaned over to Kalea. I leaned over to Kalea and was like, "Okay, not even the people on stage are dancing. You need to yeah. change the song." <laughs> and apparently, this was like their fourth year that they had this. Yeah. So it must be successful. I mean, I would definitely go again. All right, what's happening to you? Y'all don't know. I love Hawaiian pizza, but apparently everyone hates it. I'm also proud of this makeup. It stayed on all night. A lot of people on stage I was dancing. You'll probably see in this vlog. But it was the same people dancing. I mean, they weren't bad. But I'm trying to see the music video sometimes, especially when BTS comes on. Like, y'all need to move out the way. No, but they Dang. were great, though. I wish I they could were dance great. like that. There was this one girl. She knew every single song. So, this like... One, one in the white? Yeah, the one in the white with the curly hair. Right, yeah. So it it's really one good. thing if you know the song, but she actually like pulled it off. Yeah, I felt the emotion like coming off. It took me to figure out like what that creepy sound was. It's literally just the Howard maintenance building. <laughs> so, like, what nice is place? that? Yo, there's ghosts out here in DC. We can't come here anymore. I see her. We're almost there. That's the power of the club, girl. She's literally like this in every vlog. I told y'all bedtime's at eight. I only go to the club like twice a year. I can't do this all the time. Introverts and clubs don't match. Exactly. We went to a K-pop club, y'all. That was awesome. Never thought I'd get to shake my at home, but here I am. <laughs> In public with other people. Exactly. I'm also like very surprised of how many like black people there were. I know. Awesome. Oh, wait, what time is it? We forgot to tell the vlog what time is it. It is 2.15 a.m. I don't know. Yeah. You could see like everyone when BTS came on, the whole entire club Yo, was like every, lit. So why like would you white, not exactly. play more? Why would you Boys, play girl, play? white, black, everyone was shaking it when BTS came on. Listen, why are they always doing BTS wrong? Well, dramatically against. <laughs> I'm gonna put that montage. That was the best part about tonight, little dreams.
Yeah, the drinks are really good. Yeah. There's like these lemon shots and they're only like $5. You got lemon shots? Yeah, they're good. What? I mean, you didn't like I did. I was like, you anytime. Know, your vlog is canceled. <laughs> you were like, anytime. Over, you were like, your tab's over there. You were like, I'll meet you guys over there because my tab's over there. And I was like, drink? Okay. I won't forget this. <laughs> we got you next yeah, time. Yeah, we got you next time. The bartenders were nice. Yeah, they were. Yeah. Even if I dropped 40 bucks on drinks. Oh my god. I dropped 50. I like, like 50. Like financially, I can't it. And 50 wasn't bad. I got like, I brought everyone shots. I got myself shots. I got two refills of what was that called? It was Bacardi and Pineapple. Bacardi and Pineapple. Honestly, you guys should get out more and do stuff like this. I never even thought there was like a K pop club. And the club was like 18 and up. So. I mean, basically anyone can get in. Blackpink and got seven. Those are the only can honor. Can I just say shout out yeah. to my fellow Agassiz because there was only <laughs> two of us in that building tonight. I just want to say. She's a got seven fan, like a huge got seven fan. <laughs> and the curly, the girl with the curly hair and the white t-shirt knew every she song. Funny. She was killing it. It was just me and her the whole They were like the only ones just twerking up like. <laughs> I'm learning all the choreographies so I can go up there and represent. Yeah, if they play more Blackpink, you know I've been up there. And everyone was very accepting of multi-fandoms. Like I know some people get weird about like having different biases, but like everyone was pretty cool about it. All right, it will look terrible. It's the next day and we survived. Barely. So it turns out the thing ended at three, but we left a little bit before two because we were just so done. Yeah. I was tired of, whoa, I just saw your lens. I was tired of waiting for them um, to play BTS. Like, if you're not taking requests, you're not taking requests. Yeah. But it was still fun, I decided. Even if I was, like, salty and drunk about it last night. I feel like I got beat up and what? lost a fight, and then I wanted a rematch, and I still lost. That's how I feel right now. I need more lighting in this room. I look dead. I need to redo this. I'm ahead of the vlog. I know. I don't even have a bra on. I apologize for looking this rough. I don't always look like this. I look like a fetus that came out early. <laughs> the event ended at three. Ew, I look dead. But we left at two because we were just over it. I remember we were outside like filming, complaining about the music. And I do have a complaint with the 2.5 songs, but it was 10 to 3. And I kept thinking, I don't know how I'm gonna survive after 12. But when I looked at my like Fitbit, it was like 120. And I was like, dang, it's almost time to go already. <laughs> I don't even know how to describe the songs. They were old. It was like a lot of girl groups that like not a lot of people knew. That's a lie, because they were dancing to every single song. There was one song where even the dancers were dancing, and that's yeah. when I was like, I've reached my limit. <laughs> At least we got all of Fab Say. I'll take it. It was lit when that came on. I was waiting for Dionysus to come on too. Oh, okay. Someone would have got trampled on during that. <laughs> Clay, you want to say anything to the Lord? I don't have anything to say. It's like already getting soft. I'm happy about it, but also. All right, it's the next day after. This is probably, this is my third time recording this because of the lighting and I look like a fetus. <sighs> I see why people do this. Okay, well anyways, the club ended at three, but we left at two because we were over it. I don't even know what to say. <laughs> it was fun, but some of the songs were a pop. There was a lot of songs I didn't know how to dance to. <laughs> Probably why my knees were so shot today. Cause like half the time you spend dancing, and then half the time you spend just watching other people dance. It's like okay, but I didn't really come to watch other people dance. <laughs> like Cleo was saying, there were some songs that should have been played at the club, like Eclipse by Luna. Right? Is that something? No, I mean, like I love God Seven, but like Eclipse is not one of those songs. Oh, Eclipse by God Seven. Yeah, it's not. One of those songs. I was thinking of Luna. <laughs> Wasn't there like two DJs? Okay, the first DJ, he was cool. He was playing like some J Park, like some Monster X 17, like NCT. There's some good stuff. And then the second DJ, I don't know. I don't think they care. Yeah, it was really good at first. Yeah. And then it was like, at like after 12, I don't mean, they did that raffle. What was that? So you're really gonna like stop the vibe? 
turn on the lights pretty much or whatever and then be like okay dance off let's all just stand here oh let's start dancing again like but nobody was there at the like half the club left by the time we left and i noticed the lights slowly started to get brighter and brighter like come on like they didn't want us to be there much longer like it was cool and chill it was a little dark in the neon lights and then before we left almost all the lights were on i didn't even notice that. i believe it. it was just me props everyone who was over dancing for they didn't like, stop. <laughs> they were going all out. The guy in the all black with the muscle shirt, yeah. he was dancing ever since we got there, so I know his feet were be hurting today. He's not the pain he's in right now. No, he's probably used to that. Like the way he was dancing, he probably does that every day. He's in shape. That's what we that's what I should be. That's what we should be doing. We should be learning these choreographies to get in shape. <laughs> I was trying so hard to find a dance group. I was like, hey you guys in a dance group? Yeah, but we're not from here. I was like, dang it. And then I really want to talk to the girl in the orange hair, but every time she came off the stage I couldn't find her. She won, so I didn't record that. Hip hop knife for like the person with the orange hair or the person with the pink hair. Right. <laughs> there were so many people with different color hair, that's how we knew who was who. Julie, where'd you get that Koya pillow? At the line store. Seriously? Uh, the one in New York, but when I was in New York, I was just like on the metro. <laughs> Listen, can line sponsor me just so I can have some <laughs> merchandise? Because as you saw in my last vlog, there was nothing left. I don't think they need anyone to sponsor them. Please sponsor. Yeah. I just want some free stuff. Like this is this is all I have. This looks so sad. This is it. This is for luggage. But no, I'm a rocket because that's all they had left. Army friends. International. I don't, yeah. First of all, every single time I go there, there's so much chicken stuff left. I'm gonna throw hands at these two fans. <laughs> I don't know who it is. Is it the fans or they're just overstocking on chicken stuff because he constantly sells out? I need to know. They're like just constantly like selling his stuff like so much they have to just keep overstocking Probably. him? Or is it because y'all don't mess with my fans? I know. I feel like. <laughs> Love Shuga though. Of all the members, he's like the most like anti-capitalist. <laughs> I'm ready. For what? Drake. <laughs> I'm ready for a lot of things. Zara Larson said they did the brand new did for one year, like it took one year to make that song. So now it's just in the making for a whole yeah, year. Yeah, I saw it. It's that long to make a collab with BTS. I couldn't even work on something for that long. I would get tired of it. <laughs> This vlog for a year. The girl, like, I can record it third time. Yeah, this is my third time trying to record this because of the lighting. It catch me looking like how I looked in the last vlog. They didn't even play Boy Your Club. Are you kidding me? I'm not asking for the whole discography, but that's what I know. I don't think we got any of the current songs. I mean, home, but I mean, they didn't play like something that someone would know the choreography to because they barely play all home. Cut home mom. I know. Everyone's oh, like, yeah. what are you doing? So they try to play another song in the middle of home and we all just start yelling at them. There's a reason they call us army. Like we didn't yell at them for no other song, but when they try to do it to home, because they didn't really perform home on their concert, so we were deprived of it. Exactly. <laughs> I can like at least let us hear it in the club. We're not gonna hear it in the concert. I'm trying to shake my thing. Oh, there was one point I like turned around and like our whole group. Was just standing there with their arms crossed, waiting for BTS. I'm like, spot the army squad, like, right here in the middle of this, like, see if, like, people not moving. It'd be one thing if the BTS songs didn't get the reception that they did for yeah. them to not play any BTS songs, but, like, when BTS came on, everybody in the club went on. So, why would you not play more? I feel like there are people who are multi fandom, but, like, even they were into BTS. You guys went up and he was, like, looking at his phone. He was like pointing at his phone and he wouldn't say anything to him. Was that like I'm texting? I, think, I guess he was talking about the time, so that's why we thought, oh, okay, he probably closes at two. So we just left. And then someone else went up to request a song and they said that he he was like rude to them. Like he actually said something to them. Okay, we're gonna have to like have a meetup and talk about this. Yeah. I mean, let's be real, we've all been to like 10,000 parties where Despacito was played like four yeah. times in a row. And I'm not against Despacito, I love <laughs> Despacito, but the point is, like, if it's popular in the moment, like, you're probably gonna have to play it. Yeah. Yeah. Ew, uh, I'm gonna have to blur my face out, I'm sorry. <laughs> Where's the mask when you need it? Even if I did have a face mask, I know people are gonna be staring at me. So I just got back and I just like changed my shirt because I was looking a mess. I mean, it is the morning. 
the music was okay. I felt like it could have been better. Sorry, my cat's in the way. It could have been better. Maybe if we did the Facebook poll, we would have had different choices of songs. As you saw, there was like a ton of people that were dancing. There was probably like three people who knew like every, the dances to every single song, which was pretty cool. So I need to step up my game on that. Just the overall environment, being around everyone who like, a bunch of like-minded people. It wasn't too bad. I thought the event was fun. I would definitely go again next year. Probably have to learn more choreography because I just knew like maybe like five songs. It's like two BTS songs like that, like my friend said, and they try to like cut through half the song when they played other songs for a good six minutes. I'm pretty sure I heard like two songs twice. It was a lot. Um, the bartenders were pretty cool. Um, the drinks weren't bad. Um, I think it was a overall friendly atmosphere for the most part. Definitely felt welcome. I didn't feel weird at all. I met a lot of like really cool people. The people on the stage, they were like, I want to be their friend. And I was literally asking around like, hey, are there any like dance groups around like that are close? There was one guy who's from Richmond, um, but he said he came up, he comes up to DC a lot to perform. So if you guys know any groups in Virginia, let me know, cause I really, really like to join. I mean, even the people in my group were like, we should just make our own, but we barely even have time to come to these meetups. So it's like, when well, we have time to dance. I think my favorite person was a girl with the um, orange hair. She was getting it. There was another girl who was like an all black, um, a girl who had a blonde wig and she was like whacking. You'll probably see in the video, I haven't edited it yet. So I don't know <laughs> what I plan on showing you guys. I'm trying to think of other things. Yeah, oh my gosh. Okay, so in the beginning we had we had ramen, we went to this ramen place and we don't know what we were thinking because it was already very hot outside and we were expecting to go inside and it was gonna be like, you know, air conditioning. No, it was more like an open restaurant. So like the heat from the grill, we were sitting next to the grill. We were all like sitting close together. We had like, had to have three tables cause we had a lot of people. And then we had hot ramen. I don't know, I got spicy. <laughs> got spicy ramen it was just a very hot and humid environment like i was sweating so bad sorry i was just sweating so bad and good thing i wore like a black top and like a white skirt so you couldn't see the sweat but it was it was good though we're about to leave and it just started pouring down raining and we're like are you serious we're like sprinting trying to find trying to get to the next place and it was just it was bad. Like I spent, you know, I spent so much time straightening my hair and then I curl it and then my step outside was humid and then it's gonna rain. And so now my hair is just puffy. When we finally got there, the rain stopped. My friend dropped her bag and like the cap turned her makeup stick. It was just a mess. And there was some guy, my friend said he saw them go to the back, the back alley with like a backpack on. And when he came back out, that's when we saw him, he didn't have a backpack on. And he kept saying, the word for a woman is the B word. He just kept saying that and we were all like, just don't look at him, don't look at him. And then one person ended up looking at him and he like came back and I was like, oh no, like, oh, don't look at him. And then right when he left and then came back a second time after like maybe five or 10 minutes and he was like starting to get more aggressive. And then they let us in the club. We're like, oh, thank goodness. Cause we didn't know what was about to happen. I can't fight, but I was ready to fight that night. That was pretty much our weekend adventure. It's always a mess when we meet up. Next one, we're getting Bingsu ice cream and maybe shop around a little bit. It should be fun. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog again. I don't know what to expect what you guys are gonna see because I haven't even edited it yet and my last one just went up and I got a good response from people. So yeah, I'll see you next time. Okay, one thing I really like about Julie's apartment, well not one, multiple things, <laughs> is that like all her like BTS collection.